Happy Saturday. So I've been thinking a lot lately about this question. What am I going to be remembered for? How am I touching the lives of the people that are around me? You know, what is the energy that I'm putting off that's going to make me memorable once I'm gone? This is important because I have people around me that I want to influence while I'm here and when I'm gone. Reality is is that we we don't live forever. And so when I'm not on this planet anymore, what am I going to be remembered for? Why are people even going to remember me? I, I read all this information about these great people that have lived and touched you know millions of lives and continue to touch millions of lives after they're obviously perished or gone and you know what is it that I can do to get to that level of achievement that level of awareness that level of uh, respect especially with those that you know I grew up around or that I have an opportunity to touch their lives and it helps me to live better, it helps me to think more about the way that I live my day-to-day -day life. The energy that I put out there, the way that I speak to people, the information that I study to become a better individual. You know, am I taking advantage of every opportunity to learn and to become a better person? I was um watching a documentary yesterday about um the guys that funded Google now I'm not saying they're the best people in the world but one of them I can't remember which one was 19 years old when he was studying at Stanford for his PhD not only is that a great deal of you know capacity as far as your brain is concerned at a young age but also you know think about the amount of knowledge that that individual was soaking up between the ages where he f was able to first pick up a book and start reading and consuming information till that age of 19 years old i mean he had to have been able to just digest information extremely quickly and i thought about that because we as human beings should be digesting information that can help us improve the way that we live so we can influence people you know obviously those guys google the founders are going to have influence and will continue to influence millions and billions of people once they're gone but how can i take that kind of mindset and capacity and put it into my day-to-day -day living as far as like researching and trying to extract knowledge that can help me to leave behind a legacy that is worth a darn because as we get older you know we care more about what we should we should care more about the way that we touch people's lives you know are we loved are we cherished do you know how many people are going to be there at your funeral you know and and even if you know I don't want to have a funeral but if if you have you know how many people are gonna grieve how many people are gonna be you know or not necessarily grieve how many people are gonna say well you know I'm upset that person's gone because they did this for me what is that this gonna be or what is it that people are gonna think about when I'm gone or when you're gone or you know why would you why is your existence memorable that's that's very serious so you know I don't want to go on too much about it but I've been thinking about that lately and um, yeah maybe you can get some uh, value out of that and um, maybe to help you find some better ways to live or better ways to go about understanding the way that you are perceived understanding the way that you are
looked at from those that are on the outside looking in what do those people really feel in their heart happy saturday